everyone hello grade 6 let's study together unit 8 in the time for English book let's read the dialogue the dialogue is between Mrs. Dina and the little girl called Mona let's read Miss Dina Mona please come to the front write the letter D on the board Mona I don't know how I'm sorry Miss Dina Miss Dina that's okay let me show you how it's easy no no i can't it's too hard come on mona don't give up mona hey i can't do it miss dina good work mona please sit down judy please help me pass out the homework hassan clean the board please girl what did you get the boy i got a hundred the Mo mona yeah, so did I. So, from reading this conversation, we will learn that the orders must be formed in the infinitive form. Yani, I have to say play, not blaze. Eat, not eat. Okay? Let's now read the activities. The activities are important because it came all usually in the choose questions. And this is our main question, by the way. So, I have to learn the verb and the noun that came before it, after it. يعني مثلا, I can say what? I can say the alphabet. Or, I can eat the alphabet. I can say the alphabet. And go on. Let's read the activities. Say the alphabet. Throw a ball. Blow a bubble. Count to ten. Build a sand castle. Spell a word. Catch a butterfly. Peel an orange, speak English, cut out a heart. But let's now answer some questions together. Sarah can eat to ten. Yes, can count. I could eat a bubble. Yes, I could blow a bubble. I can eat English. I can speak English. Let me show you how to eat out a heart. Yes, to cut out a heart. Ola built a, a on the beach last summer. Ola built a sand castle. And go on. Now let's read the grammar part. Here our rule is easy. We are talking about the verb to be. The verb to be in the present and in the past. It has three shapes in the present and two shapes in the past. In the present, verb to be changed to am with I is with he or she or it and are with the they you we so what about the past it takes the shape of was with i he she it and where with they we you let's read some example here i am a new pupil in this school heba is tall my friend were at my home yesterday Top two form is a sentence in the negative. We will add not after B. He isn't a lazy boy. You weren't late. And to form a question, we're gonna start with am or verb to be plus the subject. Am or is or are in the present or was or were in the past plus the subject and the rest of the question. And the answer usually is that for the question that to start with verb to be, the answer will be a yes, yes or no. Yeah, but is he Egyptian? Yes, he is. No, he is. Were you at home? Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. And please focus on, the, on that where you change to I was. To form a question, WH question, we will put the WH word before the verb to be. For example, what is your job? I am a teacher. What was, when, where was he born? He was born in Cairo. To talk about the ability, we can use can or can't. I can play. I can talk. He can jump. They can fly. To, in the, to form it in the negative form, we can say I can't talk. She can't jump. They can't or cannot fly. We can change can to could, but in the past. For example, when I was little, when referred to the past. 
So, I, when I was little, I could write. So, if when I found was in the sentence, I will not use can, I will use could. When I was little, I couldn't write. طب if I found couldn't in the couldn't or could in the sentence, I will use was or were. When I was little, I couldn't write. Okay. When he was little, he could jump, and so on. Here we have an a small exercise here. Where you yesterday afternoon? Ha, huh. yesterday. So we're gonna choose was or where. Where a you you? Yeah, but I'm gonna use where. See, when I was little, I couldn't cut out a heart, but I a blow a bubble. The sentence in the past. So I can use her. Huh? I could be, but I could blow a bubble. Number three. When they a little, they could build. A sand castle. But when they, huh, a little, the sentence in the past, and we found could here, as I said, a when they were, if it was the subject to she or he or I, when I, if I was, but here they, the subject is they, if I will choose where. Now we reach it to the end of the unit, the reading time. Let's read the text together. So, we have a little boy called Karim. He wrote a letter to his friend Adam. He started with the letter with Dear, Dear Adam. Let's read. Dear Adam, how are you? When you moved away, moved away, underline it. We were sad. We miss you very much. Do you miss us? Last Saturday, we saw Miss Dina. She was out kindergarten. She was our kindergarten teacher. Do you remember her? Mona and I went to her house for lunch. She showed us old photos of our kindergarten class. She told some funny stories too. She said, when you were little, you could build enormous, very big, enormous sand castle. When you were in the sandbox at break, you never wanted to get out. Remember, do you like Oxford? It's the name of a city, by the way. Do you like Oxford? How is your new school? Are you making a lot of friends? Making a lot of friends. So, to have a friend, we can say making a lot of friends. Please write soon your friend Karim. Now, let's answer some question. When you a away, huh? We when you moved away. She a us old photos. She showed us old photos of our kindergarten class. Our teacher told us some A stories. Yes, some funny stories. Nancy built a A on the beach. Uh, what do you build in the, on the beach? Of course, sand castles. Okay, by that we end unit 8. See you later. Bye-bye.